In this brief demonstration, we will demonstrate the ability to push one button to trigger a mass emergency broadcast notification. Both of these phones are registered to Broadworks. Welcome to the single wire Informacast system. Set it has broadcast. occurred that requires evacuation. Please follow your designated evacuation route and meet outside until you receive an all clear notification. So as you can see, with one button push, it'll stream out using multicast to all phones on the network. It will also send SMS text message alerts, email alerts, and also notify participants using WebEx. Now, these two phones are registered to Broadworks, and I in turn have the Informacast Fusion product through SingleWire integrated with Broadworks. So let's take a look at this in more detail. This is my Informacast server. I have this located on premises in order to be able to stream multicast to the phones. As you can see, there are different scenarios and these are all populated to the app on my iPhone. And these can be customized as you see fit. I also can create recipient distribution lists. I can create notifications based upon templates and I can stream out to multicast to all the Cisco IP phones that are on a given subnet. So here we have all the phones in the building. Here is the multicast address as well as the port number. And I have configured this on the actual Cisco IP phones to allow them to receive a multicast message. In terms of configuring the one button to push that we had on the 8800 series phone, for that I would go down to SIP registrations. You can see that we have this is actually registered to Broadworks. So we have basically a SIP server group and we have it registered to Broadworks using our user ID, which is a telephone number, and then we have our Broadworks server. And then on the Cisco IP phone itself, I would create a speed dial to this telephone number and that would in turn route it to the single wire and trigger the broadcast notification. You can also see all of the Informacast mobile notifications that I have received. And in addition, inside of WebEx, I have received a notification. I can play that notification, but I can also send out an Informacast message using WebEx. So I can simply choose the bot, then type send, and then type the actual template. So I will do Informacast send evacuate, and that in turn will trigger my Cisco IP phones, as well as SMS and email notifications. So that concludes the demo. Thank you very much.